LinkedIn has released a new ad type called Thought Leader Ads. In the past, one of the biggest limitations with LinkedIn ads is that they all had to be run through a company page. But in a lot of cases, you're building your followers, you're writing all your posts, you're creating the most engagement on your personal LinkedIn page. So this provides a workaround where you're actually able to advertise posts on personal pages. Now let's walk through how to do that. So here I am in the campaign manager. I'm gonna go to create campaign. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna create a campaign a very basic campaign that's just for brand awareness. And we're going to use the single image ad type. So there's nothing out of the ordinary here. The trick is really going to come down to the end when we select the ad type. So I'm going to go with one of my saved audiences here, which happens to be uh, a list of about 85,000 people working in the SaaS industry with specific countries, et cetera, et cetera. I'm not going to enable audience expansion. Make sure you have single image selected as your ad type. I'm going to uncheck LinkedIn audience network. I'm going to set a daily budget of $10 and I'm going to hit next and save. Here, instead of creating a new ad, we're going to browse existing content. And instead of selecting direct sponsored, you're going to go all the way to the right here and select employee. In my case, I'm just going to search for myself as an employee. And then what you can see here is some of my recent posts. Now, LinkedIn is only going to provide pagination up to seven here. Uh, so if you want to promote older posts, what you're probably going to have to do is go ahead and repost those so that they show up. Now, I recently did that and there's a delay, so it hasn't shown up yet. Uh, but you can certainly just do a completely new post and uh, repurpose content that you've released in the past. So what you would do is, for example, request permission from your employee to post this as an ad. So I'm going to hit request there and send. Now, uh, in my case, I didn't actually receive the request. So there's another quick workaround, which is go to view requests and copy the link. And then when you paste the link into Chrome or your, whatever your browser is, you can hit approve here. This is a great way to build your personal brand, perhaps to elevate the thought leadership of the CEO in your company or some spokesperson, perhaps an influencer associated with your company. It's also a great way to amplify posts that have been particularly effective. So for example, I had one that had uh, 15,000 impressions celebrating uh, the number of enrollments that I had in my courses and the fact that I became a, a, an official partner. So uh, these types of things are going to be very effective in, in elevating personal posts in ways that were not possible before with LinkedIn.